Oh my lord, no! Alright, so what do I do? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Brave Angler. Today we are on episode episode two. Why 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 do you have an Australian accent? <laughs> Shrimp on the bob. Eh? Signing on is the Brave Angler Ress. Mm. Welcome to Lake Yale, you guys. And welcome back to the Brave Angler. Today we are practicing for our tournament. We weren't able to do the one on Black Friday, unfortunately, because I had to go to work and Stevie's partner dipped out on him. But needless to say, December 10th, we have a tournament out here. So we are out here practicing. So let's go catch some fish. Hurry up, baby. That's only 10 pound line. <laughs> on the Sexy Shad third cast. That's better than what you've been getting too. Yeah. Ooh. Okay, this is the, not the fun part about the Sexy Shad. Do you want pliers? Yeah. All right, guys. My first bass on the Sexy Shad. <laughs> Yay! Oh, he's pretty decent. Nice. He, he got jacked up by that. All right, fish number two. All right, let's go to the next spot. Oh, oh. <laughs> Quick, get your sexy shad ready. Get it back in, get it back in. They just blew up on a shad. And my bait fish isn't getting deep enough. Quick, throw ahead. Right, right there. There you go, there you go. Perfect, perfect, perfect. That was a big one too. Maybe we're not leaving here. Maybe we're just switching bait. That was a, I would say probably a four pounder. You know, on the bright side, we've at least got a bigger bag than we got last time. And we did it with two fish. Come on, hurry up and bite it. Come on. Oh, I'm gonna pick up my sexy shed. I'm gonna have to put on those bigger jerk baits here in a second well like i said right now they're chasing shad so anything that emulates shad is going to work i'm about to throw that giant swim bait back in there maybe he'll go for that oh there he is no oh come on he got it right at the boat come on. dang Dang. One of these guys out of the cover here with a big shad. Come on, it's nice and juicy. Little skip action. I know, I know a lot of y'all probably dissing on that, but just think about it for a second. Shad literally, when they panic, they skip all over the top. So, just saying, in theory, to them, it's, you know, a shad that's panicking, heading right their direction. Yeah, we gotta get the giant jerkbait mold. All right, our next stop. Yeah, go, go down this uh, embankment. Actually, go to these docks right quick. I'm gonna skip this giant shad under them. Put your sexy shad right there. Right where that water comes out. And while you do that, I am going to throw this uh, thing under this uh, dock. There's gotta be fish set up on this. Oh no, I don't have them good. Oh, I didn't have them hooked good. Dang it. I didn't realize it was fish. I thought it was stuck. Dang it. Good thing is he didn't hook himself. So he might go back for it. Let that sink down a second.
Oh. No! Oh my lord, no! That was literally like a dolphin. Did you see that? That was like a three pounder. Gosh, man. Man, dang it, man. Ooh, that's way up under there. That should be a fish. Oh, that should be a fish. That's not a fish. Ooh, it's a good one. Bring him in, bring him in, bring him in. You got the camera? Yeah. Bring him in. Yeah. We might actually win this tournament. He's skinny, but... Look at that. Fish number two. Three. three. Well, for you. Two for you, one for me. I've lost two. If anything, I'm hurting the team. Oh, there's eel grass all around us. Yep, we're we're in the middle of them now. We're here. How do I mark it? I'll mark it. Oh, that's that's a gar. That is a huge gar. That is a giant gar. <laughs> That's why I'm in the water. I just let this sink to the bottom. Damn it. What is that, four? Switch back to the sexy shad here in a second. Let's see if I can't get something near this cover right quick. Is that a bite? Oh, got him. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm like, you can't lose another one. Oh, man, he's fat. Look, a little bit of line up. Sorry, I got to keep us from going in the weeds. I hook sack the crap out of him. Oh he's heavy. So now we have to figure out. Yeah, he's probably a three pounder. Oh, that's our fifth one. Yep. Sweet. Add to our bag. Oh my gosh, there's so many. They're all big. Oh no, he's gonna overflow the water in here. Nah. He will. It's all the way up at the crack. Yeah, we need to get our own big jerk bait because. This is a good way to get bigger fish. And after this one bite, this jerk bait's done. You know, there's two sides. You don't have to put them all on one side. Oh. Well, I think it's on the floor clock, because they're all stuck in there. They're pissed. Yay, babe, we made our bag. I want to win. Like, I'm not, 
I want to win. That's all I need. I'm into the jerk bait phase of my fishing journey. I've caught two out of my three fish off of the jerk bait. All right, guys. So we just hit the time limit. We caught five fish today. We lost two good ones. You know, I wasn't able to get them in the boat, but we were able to catch a five fish bag between me and Caroline. And uh, honestly, like, I think, uh, I think if we can get 10 pounds, it'll be a solid, you know, first tournament. That is my goal. Um, of course we would like to win, but like I said, solid 10 pounds. So we're going to go ahead and weigh out these fish that we caught today. Um, see, uh, see if we're going to get close to that. All right. Fish number one, one pound, two ounces. They're going rogue. I told you they do that. <laughs> I'm Here is fish number six. Yeah, that's the big boy. Why does it say six? Because I told you I just grabbed a random one. All right. So what, this is our biggest? That's your one you just caught, yeah. All right. We are, no, that can't be right. Hold on a second. <laughs> that can't be right. What did it say? What did it say? Tell us. It's like one pound. Oh. All right, two pounds. Not looking good for us. All right, bud, thanks for biting. Just keep pulling out all the colored things and see if anybody's attached. How much easier this time? Because <laughs> they're bigger. I don't know. <laughs> All right, next one. We got one pound, seven ounces. Okay. I feel like you're wanting to get splashed. <laughs> That's a decent one. Yeah, no, a lot of those were. Yeah. Like I said. All right. Let's see, hopefully this is another two pounder. Let's see. Of course, freaking scale is freaking stupid. All right, one pound, fifteen ounces. Wow. So close. <laughs> so close. And the last guy. Oh, this one's the one with the shark. Yeah, I know. That's the one that made me bleed. <laughs> All right. For the last guy. He's so feisty. He's mean. Did he make you bleed too? Uh, one pound, 12 ounces. Wow. You little screwball, man. <laughs> I swear. All right, guys. Here's the numbers. 8.25. Yeah! Much better bag than last time. <laughs> yeah, I'd say so. And like I said, we at least caught a whole bag, so. Yeah, I would say today is pretty successful, so let's uh, go ahead and get the boat back to the ramp and we'll uh, close this for you. All right. All right, guys, so there you have it. If you like this kind of content, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I think we're going to do very well in the tournament. Hopefully we can do a little better today, but we at least know where the fish are at. So we're going to practice one more time before it's tournament time in two weeks. Like Caroline said earlier, unfortunately we couldn't do our last tournament, but we're going to make up for it this tournament. All right. So funny thing is though, like this showed us one thing, we need big jerk bait. So we went ahead and ordered a big jerk bait mold. So be on the lookout for that coming soon and we're going to be filming our next practice and the tournament for you guys so make sure you guys are looking out for that now go catch a fish now go catch a fish now go catch a fish <laughs>